we've already removed the controller and we've disconnected our battery. So we're just gonna start to install the mounting plate for it. And we'll just tighten up the screws we just put in. Next, we'll mount our TAC2 controller. And then we'll just tighten up the bolts we put in. Then we'll attach our battery negative cable. And then we'll connect our phase cables. You can reuse the A1 and A2 cables from the DC motor and we'll reuse those as our U and V cables. In the kit we've included an extra cable that will be used for W. So we'll just go ahead and connect our cables now. Make sure you do connect the cables U to U, V to V, and W to W. Next we'll add our battery positive cable. And we'll install, we'll connect the vehicle harness. We also need to connect the sensor harness from the motor. And if you have the on the fly programmer, you can install it now as well. Included with the kit is a bracket for mounting your run tow switch. You can just use this up with the, uh, on the top corner of the controller and that gives you a nice place to keep your run tow switch. And that completes the installation of the TAC2 controller into the EasyGo TXT48.